you're misusing the word ho. <laughs> it's an interjection used to call attention to a destination, not an object, as in a land ho or a westward ho. <laughs> Guys, what you doing? Going out to discover electricity? <laughs> if you're referring to the work of Benjamin Franklin, he did not discover electricity. He merely used a kite to determine that lightning consists of electricity. He also invented the Franklin stove, bifocals, and the flexible urinary catheter. <laughs> kite ho. We're heading out for some kite fighting. Kite fighting? Oh, yeah. It's an extremely competitive cutthroat sport. <laughs> well, actually, the risk of throat cutting is very low. On the other hand, severe string burn is a real and ever-present danger. <laughs> Wallowitz is trying to outflank us. Let out some string at altitude and I'll go under and cut his line. Why wouldn't Penny want her friends to meet me? Focus, Leonard, focus. The heat of battle is upon us. The dogs of war unleashed. <laughs> Because her Polly's right, maybe I embarrass her. But you're embarrassing me right now. A grown man worrying about such nonsense? We're in the middle of flying kites? <laughs> Sorry. Sorry won't bring their kites down. <laughs> oh, string worm, string worm! <laughs> oh, they think we're flanking. They're playing right into our hands. At the count of three, we execute the flying scissor. One, two, Whoa. three. You see that? See what? That chick, she smiled at me. No, she didn't. Yes, she did. Come on, scissors, scissors. Hold my line. What are you doing? I got scissors by myself. How would come back? <laughs> Victory! Son of a bitch. You're a sucky friend, you know that? A sucky, sucky friend. What was I supposed to do? She gave me that come hither look. If she gave you any look at all, it was a you suck look. I would have caught up to her if I hadn't pulled a hammy. Oh, please. You weigh 80 pounds. You don't have a hammy. So Penny doesn't want me around her friends. I embarrass her. What else could it be? Well, her actions could be out of concern for your feelings. Perhaps she's excluded you from these gatherings because she's scouting for a new mate and doesn't want to do it in front of you. Oh, how kind of her. Agreed. Most primates don't show that sort of discretion. A female bonobo will copulate with a new male in front of the old one without so much as a how do you do? I always do this, you know? You ditch me for a woman you don't have a shot with. I totally had a shot. With a woman you were chasing through a park. That's not a shot, that's a felony. <laughs> it's worse, it cost me my prized patang fighting kite. Sheldon, I don't suppose there's any chance you could give me my kite back. I'm sorry, Raj, but the rules of aerial warfare dictate that the falling kite go to the victor. And without rules, the competition has no meaning. And without meaning, the following would be an empty gesture. I have your kite. I have your kite. <laughs>